getting a feeling of deja vu I'm going up these steps again so last week I was here and I went to Lumpini Park and today I'm gonna to walk the Green Mile they're always steps <laughs> always steps Right, I probably mentioned this last time. Saracen Road, Whittier Road or Wireless Road. Um, that's where the walk ends or starts depending on which way you go. We're starting off at the Lumpini end. And this particular walkway actually links quite a few places parallel to Circumvit. Circumvit Road. Um, Lumpini, by the way, uh, you can probably see a roof there around here. That's a school, and then Lumpini Park's just there. So it's probably become apparent why I call it the Green Mile. It's actually just over one kilometre, apparently. This looks suspiciously like a short stay hotel. This is where you come with your mistress or whoever for a short time. Traditional Thai house there, wooden house. And garden. Talk. Nice yellow house. back size the place where you can get down here sweeping the leaves off the roof Temple at the back there. You do have to be careful walking around here. I mean, there's lots of dog shit everywhere. <laughs> That's interesting, isn't it? It says ring bell here and you can get some bubble tea. From the shop up the bottom. If you want some bubble tea and you're on this walk, look out for these, because this is where it is. Walking and cycling. Kimono Cafe. Somebody's just graduated. Having some pictures taken.
Yeah, it seems like these little pollies are quite common. There's another one here. A ramp there so if you've got a bike you can go up and use the ramp to get your bike up let's go up the steps the roosters. Just looking back to where we've been, you can see downtown Bangkok there, business district. And we're walking along following this line of pylons, electrical pylons. This over here is one of the motorways that go out of Bangkok. And you can see another walkway that goes over that bridge. Maybe I'll do that someday. There's not a lot of people around, but it's quite embarrassing filming and talking at the same time. You look like you're completely insane. <laughs> oh, it was already filming. <laughs> right, so here you go. Venture Kitty Park, I think it's called. Bit of a wetland there. There's the guy we saw earlier on on the path, going for a cycle. Some tourists. I think I'll walk on this sky bridge and then come back round the other way. Seems like a plant. Just doing a pan shot looking back to the green mile where I just was. You can see the blue bridge there. And this is the Skyway, or Skywalk I think it's called. Skywalk. That I'm on. So one of the things that I would say about this park is there's not a lot of cover. So I'm walking around now. It's literally midday, just coming up to 12 o'clock. And it's uh, pretty warm. Here's the cycle paths. Some guys down there having a snack in the shade, maybe lunch. I don't really want to walk the full length of the park, to be honest because I've still got to do the green mile. Um, I would say that I'm about halfway in at the moment. 
So what I'm going to do is come down and then come back. It's quite a big park actually, I think it's a lot bigger than Lumpini. And I really do like, even though you get scorched, I do like these walkways. So yeah, if you carry on to the left, the path carries on. I'm not convinced there's going to be anything spectacular to see if I follow that particular path. So we'll head back to the Green Mile and carry on on our little walk. Back on the uh, Green Mile again. So that was weird. My phone actually packed up because of the heat. So I didn't get all the shots that I wanted. There's the park there. And I believe it's built on the old tobacco monopoly. And that's at the back of the soap there. Or was. It's down here. Well, we won't go that way. A Prattenham there, Watergate. Some houses. Some device cleaning the water. Some more steps. So this is the entrance to what used to be the back home monopoly, I believe. A little bit of a bridge, and that's Soy 4, Nana Soy 4, where you'll find Nana Plaza and a few English pubs, amongst other things. Always bloody steps. go. Gate that side. Soy for that side I believe. Okay so the Bangkok Green Bridge which is the official name or as I keep calling it the Green Mile is 1.6 kilometers long and it connects Benja Kitty Park and Lumpini Public Park. It was opened in 1999 and then upgraded in 2022 when they widened it in some places and they did add street lighting and this was because some women who were up there were getting harassed by guys who were just hanging out I guess up there and they did add CCTV at that time. And One of the other things they did was add a stainless steel fence which had the pleasure of touching in that incredible heat and uh, I burnt my fingers so don't don't touch the fence it's much nicer down here it's a lot cooler there's nice <coughs> cool breeze blowing through so that's nice nice and cool while you're walking let's see if we can zoom in on that blighter sure if I've got an insure. Sure. One of the things with living in Bangkok or just being in Bangkok is you're never more than a couple of feet away from another person. It's actually a very very busy city. 
but this is like a little oasis away from the hustle and bustle of Circumvet and other places. It's actually a bit quieter today anyway. We're a day off from New Year. It's nearly the end of 2023. But look, there's nobody on the path that way. There's nobody on the path that way. There's just no one around. Which is great, I don't feel so self-conscious speaking to myself. <laughs> anyway, it is what it is. I think we're nearly at the end. So the last last time I came down here was with a friend of mine, John Sunter and his girlfriend. And I'm not sure whether that was 2018, 2019. And we did this very same walk and it was nothing like this with the park on the right side. Anyway, we're going to get to the end. There's a little bridge. This was full of holes last time we came down here. Really dangerous it was. I wonder if they've done it up. Well, we'll find out momentarily. Nice old house there. Yep, this is Bangkok. Believe it or not. Camera's up now as well. Don't think they were there last time. Another rickety bridge. Oh, the park goes on over there. Okay, cool. There you go. Here's a rickety bridge. I think you can get through. the end of the walk, the end of the park and that's where we've come let's see if you can get out here used to be able to nice house And we're out. We'll follow the side up and then you can see the opposite way of how to get to the park and how to get on that green mile. Well, it does take about 20 to 30 minutes to walk the full route which isn't particularly long and you do get to walk in different areas so there's a section that goes over people's housing which you'll see and you go over a motorway and then once you get on the other side there's a little bit of a clong that you can follow down to a rickety bridge which you'll see and then you go over and there's a gate and I always think it's going to be locked but it was open and I managed to get through okay so there, there you go a bit more information for you So if you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe, share with your friends and don't forget to press the bell. Thanks for watching.